Okay, let's return Kate's book to her. See if we can find it in my room. Assuming it's on the bookshelf, maybe? No? Search. No book here. Uh, search. Is that it? <sighs> Damn it! She just spilled soda on Kate's book. Rewind. Better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Move. Be gone, foul softer. <laughs> Take. Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. All right, let's go return this. Wait, did I look at this? Okay, yes I did. Phone. Did I look at my phone? Time travel stuff. All right. I need to get dressed before I go there. Oh, well, okay then. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact That's suit fine. for every day of the week, and he couldn't even rewind time. Okay, it's a different shirt. I was like, is that the same outfit from... <laughs> now I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. The first As episode. if I have to worry about being late anymore. I do have all the time in the world now. Yeah. Private number. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything or I'm coming for your ass. I know where you sleep. I bet that's... Uh, Nathan? I'm guessing. Oh, shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? Yeah. It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. But it could be any- Kate? You in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Max. She's so sad. Look. Kate is all alone dealing with this video bullshit. I hope her mother doesn't disown her. Kate, your father and I have just received a rather disturbing call from the Principal Wells from Principal Wells about you and some party video. Our concerns about sending you to Blackwell seem justified. Please call us after your classes this evening so we can fully discuss this matter. We hope you haven't brought shame on you or our family. We'll pray for you and expect you to pray for forgiveness. That's so sad. Kate used to play the violin every morning. She stopped last week. It's depressing. Kate's art is perfect for a children's book. <laughs> Everything looks so fun and colorful and positive. Cloth. Does she not like looking at herself? Why did she cover up the mirror? If she can't look at herself? so dark in here. Kate really has a doting father. Katie, you'll always be my brightest light against the dark. That's a lot of tears. She's going to go through boxes. Aw, little bunny. So cute. <laughs> got demon eyes though. It's like black eyes. <laughs> um, nice. Hey, I'm trying to use my powers for good. This letter. Ouch. She left out amnation. Dear Katie, no spirit or devil could have prepared me for what you have done in that videotape. And like a Jezebel, you released your harlot image before God's eye. I will pray with my church for your soul to be saved from eternal hellfire. Like, what if that's not her, though? Like, we still don't know if it's really her. Good Lord. This must be Kate's H.R. Geiger period. Yeah. Kate's room is usually immaculate. For her, this must be a pigsty. 
She's depressed, man. People are being mean to her. Maybe Kate has a split personality. Church girl by day, party monster by night. Don't make any assumptions. Kate even makes notes in her Bible. My parents never once took me to church. I had nothing to rebel against. I don't know what to believe now. When justice is done, it brings joy to the righteous, but terror to the evildoers. Photo. Damn, it's the all-American zombie family. <laughs> Open the blinds. It's way too emo in here. Kate isn't that gloomy. Until lately. Make sure I look at everything. Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. <laughs> She's a pretty girl. All right, let's talk to her. Um, uh, hey, Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? Uh, I hate bullies. I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. Um... Why? Why does he think that? Because he saw the video. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. I don't know what to say. That's awful. So, how did that happen? It's a long story. I'm still trying to sort it all out. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. Did someone, like, drug her or something? Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me Nathan. to the hospital. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite yeah. of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And... And what? And? That's all I remember. Oh, okay. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm oh my room the God. next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. That's terrible. Like, that's 
serious. Jesus, this is intense. If Kate wasn't out of it and is actually telling the truth. Oh my God. I feel terrible for her. So Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate, anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. He hurt you. Should I go to the police? Oh, shit! Oh my god, don't do this to me. <laughs> Damn it, Kate. <laughs> Why? Why? Let's do the look for proof one first and see what happens. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're they on won't. video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Ugh. Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other okay. things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. No, God damn it. Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. Let's see what she says when I say go to the police. How do I make it go faster again? Go faster. Why do you have to ask me? Yes, you should definitely go to the police, Kate. I totally believe every word you say. Nathan Prescott is truly dangerous. Bless you, Max. I will go to the police. And also Principal Shit. Wells. With you as my backup witness, they'll have to take us seriously now. Backup oh, witness? Oh, no. Well, I mean, I believe you in everything, but we're still just spoiled what? punk students to the cops and faculty. I just think we need to be very careful here. Why? Careful of what? Nothing. Except the Prescotts are a powerful family. I hope this won't backfire on us, that's all. Even though that rich bastard has earned some serious bad karma. He'll get it. Is that it? <laughs> Damn it. Time out, Max. You actually told Kate to go to the police and the principal after getting a scary text threat. Now the police will definitely drag you into this shit. Shit. I really think we need to wait though. I don't think we should go to the police. I really don't. We can't prove anything. I'm gonna go back and tell her to wait. It, I hate when she gets upset with me, but I feel like it's the right decision. Go faster, please. I could be wrong though. Skip. Look for, for proof first. If you do that, she's... Sorry, I'm sorry, Kate. I'm so sorry. She's gonna hate me. She's never gonna talk to me again. I'm sorry. I love you. See you later. Oh my god, I feel so bad. I feel so bad. I feel like it'll be worse, though.
Once I leave, I think that's it. I don't think I can go back. <sighs> Shit. Max. Food. Two whales. See you there. Don't hurt your fingers texting. Yay, breakfast. No emoji. <laughs> okay. I feel terrible. Ah, I'm so scared. That was the wrong decision. I really don't know. I'm really... Can we talk to them some more? Please? Let's talk later, Max. No. Did, uh, Juliet go in her room? Brooke? I don't have time, Max. I can't talk now. You're kind of a bitch, you know that? <laughs> Alright. Here we go. I'm about to walk out. <sighs> okay, I'm going. <sighs> that was a tough decision, and this just started. That was my first decision. I feel terrible, but... I mean... Remember how the principal reacted when, uh, maybe I didn't do it. I did it the second time, just to see what happened. Um, if you told the principal that Nathan had a gun in the bathroom, he didn't, he was not having it. Birds. Samuel. The birds are flocking around Samuel. Are you feeding the birds? Hey Samuel, you're up early. Oh, hello young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals okay. do you see in the forest? <laughs> uh, I saw a doe. Don't laugh, but... I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me, like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> what do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. <laughs> My spirit animal is a squirrel. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. I, guess. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. <laughs> He's kind of weird, but I like it. Can't Blackwell have at least one no football zone? Release the Kraken. Come on, squirrel. Oh. Time for the 15 <laughs> minutes of fame. Oh, yeah, come to big fat squirrel. Come on. Come eat the... I better not get near the bench oh. or the squirrel won't take the food. <gasps> Is he gonna take it? He keeps waiting for me to walk farther. Take it. <gasps> Can I take a picture? Don't run away. Yay. He's so cute. Yes. Another Pulitzer for the portfolio. I'm so fat. I love squirrels. Sir. Okay, uh... What's over here? That one bitch. Kate's, I mean, Victoria's little follower. The paint job looks great. Samuel knows his color schemes. Can I go in here? Like I could before? I definitely won't <laughs> play with this thing again. No, we don't need it. I can see that Samuel's concerned, but does he need a poster? How did Samuel get photos of Rachel posing? Um... What's 
that? I forgot what that symbol means. I've never seen Samuel wearing shades. And what's with this other crap? What is going on with this guy? Samuel really should keep this locked. It's a waiting accident. And too easy to sneak into. Should I go? Can I talk to him about that stuff? <laughs> like, uh, why do you have pictures of that girl? Hello again, Samuel. Hello again yourself, Max. Rachel. Sorry to pry, Samuel, but... Why are there photos of Rachel Amber in your shed? I'm curious about her. Sorry to pry, she says while prying. <laughs> now everybody wants to know about her. Oh my god. Um... Some people care. You, you know her, I'll say so that. So did you know her? Like I told the police. She was a good egg. And she gave me those photos. Oh, you talked to the police? Weird. Rachel wanted to be a model. Yeah. She gave out headshots like squirrels chasing food. Keep on prying, Max. Sounds like you have a lot of time on your hands. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. Of course you will. Um... Okay, that was kind of weird. That was really weird, actually. What's up with you? Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Just Fuck because you. you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. What the hell is wrong with these people? They're fucking assholes. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk. For once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment. So talk. You're a bitch. Uh... Victoria? Why do you hang out with Victoria? She's a bitch. She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. And she's bossy too. Look, you don't know her. I do. And she's one of the best friends you could have. <laughs> yeah. Seems like it. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. We've had our talk. No. Taylor. Conversation over. I want. Okay, wait. Let me let me backtrack here. <laughs> Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Ooh, I can do this. I've heard that your mother was sick. I'm so sorry. What what happened to her? Well, if you do care, my mom had back surgery. Victoria was there for me, like you are for Kate. I'm not about tearing people down, Max. I know. That's why I wanted to talk. I'm glad we did. Hi again, Taylor. Hey, that wasn't such a bad talk. We should do it again. I wanted to see you later. Talk to her about Kate's video. Can I go back, back again? Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Let's not fight. I don't want to fight. Skip. You're funny. Skip. Kate's video. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Why do you hang out? And she's bossy. Never mind, Taylor. That was a great talk, Max. Let's not do it again. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay. Um, just want to make sure I get the right conversation going. Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Oh my God! If I have to hear the one more time, I'm gonna stop here. Mother. Well, if you do. I know. I'm. Okay. There we go. I mean, I don't really want to be nice to her. Cause she's a bitch. Shit. The window was still broken after I warned Alyssa about the rogue football. One little thing changed the course of that window's life. <laughs> Warren? The Prescott dormitory? Good lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm? Max, it's over here. Hey, oh, your face. <laughs> Warren, what are you doing here? 
Oh, nothing? Waiting? For a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. Thank you. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, Sorry. she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Uh, um, I busted him, don't get involved. I didn't bust him though. I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. Maybe I shouldn't tell him I that. I was too scared to tell Principal Wells. Please, don't say anything. I'll give you more info later. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Sure. Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old-school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. Should I have told him about that? What happens if I don't tell him? Let's go back. Alright. Warren. Oh, nothing. Thank you. By the way. Oh, yeah. You're a real... Even though you left me... An old... I bet you were glad... He's dangerous. I don't want you to get involved. You got me there, but lay low. Nathan Prescott is going to get his karma soon. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall Yeah, yesterday. I'll just leave it at that. Speaking of dystopia... Because it ends the that same. That driving is having a... I don't want him to get... I don't want him in danger. I like him. Yes, we'll go to the yes, movie. Yes, that's... Well, that was easy. Okay. I like that. Let's move on. 